guys, welcome back to our channel. Thank you for everyone who subscribed and go ahead and stay tuned for more videos. This week I tried on four different face masks by Freeman. I'll leave a link down below so you can go ahead and check them out. So let's see how I went. Hey guys, so today is day one of trying out these face masks. Today we're trying out this one. It's the Freeman Rejuvenating Cucumber and Pink Salt Clay Mask. So let's go ahead and try it out. Okay, so I already put it on. It does feel very refreshing. And I can feel the little salts. They're pink salts. So let's go ahead and leave it on for 7 to 10 minutes. I'm gonna leave it on for 10 minutes. It is 11.27. So at 11.37, we'll clap. It's 11.37. But I think I'm gonna take it off already because it is getting a little itchy. It does say to massage your face while you're taking it off. So you can get inside those pores and clean them out. So that's what I'm doing right now. It does say seven to 10 minutes, but I think seven is fine because it did start itching a little. I do see the difference. So this is the end result. My face does feel very smooth and it does feel exfoliated. It feels clean. It's really cool. Overall, it was okay. So let's go ahead and wait for tomorrow for the next one. Hey guys, it's me too to try on these face masks. Today, we're trying on Renewing Cucumber Peel Off Gel Mask by Freeman as well. So it's this one. So let's see how it goes. I just need to apply an even coat, so I think that's an even coat. And it says 2 minutes, 7 to 10 minutes, so right now it's exactly 10.50. So I'm gonna go ahead and take it out at 11. So it's 11 already. Just like yesterday's, this one is, I do feel it a little itchy. So I think you should just leave it on for eight minutes approximately. If you have sensitive skin, cause I have sensitive skin. So maybe that's why. It does feel really cool on your face. I do recommend it. I really like this mask. It is very refreshing. You could totally smell like cucumber. It is, it says instantly refreshes and clarifies for rejuvenated skin. Well, let's go ahead and see how tomorrow's is. Hey guys, it's day three. I was gonna say four. Three. It's today is Wednesday and we're trying out the Freeman masks. So today's mask is Manuka Honey and Tea Tree Oil. This is this one? It's deep clearing clay mask and cleanser. Instantly deep cleans and absorbs oil without over drying. Oily slash breakout skin. So as you can see, my face has been breaking out. I don't know if it's because of the mask, but hopefully it's not and hopefully this helps and hopefully it feels well in my skin. So let's go ahead and try them. It hasn't even been like a few minutes and it's already absorbing into my skin. So it's 10.56. We're gonna leave it on for 10 minutes as usual. And we're gonna take it off at 11.06. So it's exactly 11.06. <laughs> the funny thing about these masks is that I can't have a lot of facial expression. <laughs> so like I wanna laugh right now because you can totally see that I'm like frozen. Anyway, just to just rinse it off with warm water and that's what we're gonna get. I 
I do feel it working and this one actually does not itch like the previous two that they itch within 7 minutes. I hope you guys can hear me, but it does feel a lot different. My skin does not feel dry. It actually feels cold like the other two. But, I don't know if you can see my breakouts. My breakouts actually don't hurt right now. They were hurting a little while ago. And right now, they just feel cool and like if they weren't there. And we'll try our last one tomorrow. So today is Thursday. It's our last day to try on these Freeman face masks. Tonight, I'm gonna try out the Pilaf clay mask. It says clearing sweet pea and lemon. It's this one. It says instantly removes impurities and tones for radiant skin. For normal to combo skin. So it's for every type of skin. Let's go ahead and try it. This one does say to leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes. So right now it's 1.57. It is a little late. I've been so busy doing a few projects this week. I couldn't go to sleep without trying the last mask. So let's go ahead and leave it on for about 15 minutes and we'll be back. Uh, so it's a little past 15 minutes. It's 2.14. <laughs> I can totally feel how the mask is already dry. So let's go ahead and try and take it off. So as you can see, it did leave a little residue. But it does say to just go ahead and wipe it off with a wet towel and it'll go away. I did get some of my on my hair. I did not wear a headband today. To be honest, this one wasn't as good as the other three that I had tried this week. The ones I really liked were the one I tried on yesterday, which was the clay mask and cleanser. The one that had anaku honey and tea tree oil. Also, the one we did the first day, which was the cucumber and pink salt. These two were my favorite. This one is really, really good on your skin if you're feeling it real sensitive because it cools it down really quick and it smells a lot like cucumber. I hope you guys liked the video. Don't forget to subscribe and click that little bell icon so you can get notifications whenever we post. If you like the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and don't forget to leave a comment if you have any suggestions or anything that you would like to tell us. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.